on the model or the the little car, there's a uh, kind of like these four little uh, pieces that are sitting on top. They're really plain looking, and when blowing up it to a scale like this, we have to make something that looks a little more interesting. So we designed this part on the computer, milled it out, and because I need eight of these, four in each cover, I'm going to have to duplicate it uh, eight times. I'd, I'd rather mold it and then cast it so that we, we don't have to sit there and mill out eight parts and finish eight parts. Step one, creating a silicone mold. They start with liquid silicone to be mixed with a chemical hardener. The ratio needed for the mixture is 100 parts silicone to 10 parts hardener. The bright blue color of the hardener tells the technician when the material is blended properly. What we need to do is pull the air bubbles out of the silicone. So we're going we're to use this vacuum uh, de-airing device. It's capable of pulling one atmosphere. What that exactly means, I don't know. If we turn this thing on and leave it open, maybe we'll all die because we'll run out of atmosphere. But um, this is important. It's a vacuum belt dryer. The shape of it's really important because it, it will not collapse. Removing this air is critical. The final mold will turn out whatever this silicone makes an impression of, including unwanted air bubbles. With the air finally out, the mixture is poured onto the plug flowing into every crack and crevice. After a 24-hour cure, the form is demolded and is ready to use. A two-part urethane will mix together for the final component, a quick-to-harden mixture that has a brief five-minute pot life. But if all is done correctly and the right mix makes it into the mold on time, after a 10 minute curing, a part is created. Instant part. I hope that all goes well. This part should fit right in there. Oh, look at that. Uh, so there's going to be four of them laid out across here equally spaced. Um, and out of this part here, there's going to be a, a spark plug wire that comes down here, and then two down here, and then they're going to kind of join in the middle and go down the center therefore kind of creating a little more detail to this 